Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here then of course welcome to you guys too. My name is Janessa Elizabeth for those who don't already know and I'm coming to you guys today with a vlog and today's vlog I'm going to take you guys with me to get content for my social media so like Instagram just Instagram actually not social media so yeah so like this is my first time I've ever done a content day solely for content creating I usually like plan it around my days out but today I've got like different outfit changes I'm, I'm gonna find some locations and just head there yeah and we're gonna go ahead to the locations and just see how it goes I'm actually like really on the fence about this because it's like getting changed and all of that so I don't know how it's gonna go so you guys are literally experiencing this with me first hand which would be hella interesting <laughs> Okay guys, just got to Canary Wharf, which is the first location. I feel like we're gonna do most of the photos here. And can I just say that, I've probably said this before in my vlogs, but this Canary Wharf reminds me of New York so much. Like the financial district and all of that. It's like, it's so built up. I'm gonna have to show you guys. Every time I come here, I'm just like, yeah. I miss New York. But yeah, the buildings are just so high here. Well, let me just show you guys. It's like its own little city. It's, it's crazy. The only difference is, is that is like a lot more quieter than what New York would be. But yeah, we're just gonna find somewhere to park and then we're gonna go from there. Bit interesting, <laughs> don't really, I can't really see any buildings that I can use to be fair, Fatma. Babe, I'm gonna park in They're that- They're all glass buildings. Canada, no, <laughs> we're gonna park buildings. in that Canada water place, shopping mall thing. Uh, uh, can you tell that we haven't planned this? Have not planned it. Canada. Just saw a few TikToks and then just went from hey, there. So we just got to Canada Water Shopping Mall um, and we're going to park here but I think I'm actually going to get a picture here because it's really quiet and it's it's nice in it so I'm just going to make it work for my first outfit and I'm just going to use this one as my first look to be fair because why not. Luckily I found somewhere that's like super quiet so I can take photos in this car park guys look. There's space everywhere. So this is location number one. I'm just gonna shine up, I mean, matte my face because it's really shiny. And then I'm probably gonna take photos right here. What do you think? Right, I feel like it looks fine there. We'll see, but I've got the whole of the, the car park to just do it. What do you think, Fatma? I think it's perfect, babes. As in like where, like this corner? Yeah, or? I like the wall. <laughs> Fatma likes the textured wall. The, the wall is very textured, actually. <laughs> It's like really bumpy, um, but yeah, it's well, cold. Do one there, one there, see them. Huh? Do one there, one there. See yeah, see okay. Them. All right. So this is my first outfit. I've just got my top on from Misguided. I've actually had this for quite some time. And then these are from Motown Books. And then obviously I've paired it with my dunks. And then I've got my Adidas, um, what's this called again? Uh, uh, is it a trench coat? Trench coat. Yeah, my Adidas um, trench coat. We've done look one and we're gonna go find a location for look two. I saw people coming through here, so I think. Yeah, so I've changed into my second outfit, which is this top that I wore on the weekend, and I've got my jeans on that I got from Motel Rock. So I'm gonna do a look in that, but I want it to be more like brighter. So we're gonna go outside because my phone's not really cooperating in the car park. We was about to um, walk into the shopping mall and we saw this really cute place. So obviously I've just stopped here to take photos. Got some photos in this look, but we're gonna go and find somewhere outside now. Even it, actually this whole place is like aesthetically pleasing right now. What do you want me to do? <laughs> Did you do it? All right, we're going to the retail mall. Because apparently mall. we're in New York. We just come out through from Canada Place and there's a location right here and it's right by the um, Elizabeth line if you guys are looking for this location because it's actually a really nice base um, and the wall's just easy. I'm gonna take some photos 
right here. Obviously, I can edit this part out of my um, my pictures, so that's not a bother. So I'm just going to do that and just take photos here. So this is location what number three? I don't know. We've been stopping and going since we came out. It might be number five, to be fair. I wish I had a hairband though, so I could just do this because these um, are a little bit slightly too um, slightly too big for me. See, but I'm going to make it work. Papa said I need to put on weight. These are actually a size small. I don't understand. Done it guys, we done it. Fatma is a real G, first of all, for being so patient. Um, we're gonna go to the toilets this time because the car's in the car park, so we're gonna go to the toilets and um, get changed into the next look. Okay guys, so I've just got changed. So I have on, let me show you guys what I have on. This one is very, this look is very clean, as Fatma would say. I got a very clean look on today. So I have on this knitted sweater from H&M and these bottoms are from H&M too. And I've still got on my dunks, but I might change them to white Air Forces just so I've got like an all white outfit on. Um, and then I'm just gonna pair with this and obviously got the cup to go with it. So this is what we're working with. Just come back to the place where I just took photos with this background, but we're gonna use this walk through here and see what happens and then we're going to walk around um, to find another backdrop because I need another setting I think. Okay, um, what are you saying Fatma? Hello stranger, it's been a minute since we last kicked it. By the way, just got in town and I won't let you nice. Fatma got the shot, she got the shot. <laughs> After she cost me, no, like, <laughs> several times. <laughs> right, guys, we're going for the next angle. This guy. The weather, guys, is banging. The weather is weathering. The sun is shining. Shout out to Fatma, plugging me with my photos. I think you need to be like here, though. Not gonna lie. <laughs> I feel like I need to put the air forces on. But right, I did bring my air forces, oh, but um, they're in the car, I completely forgot to carry them, but Fatma's got fresher air forces than mine. Oh. So I'm just gonna put hers on and she can wear my dunks for now. I'm vlogging from my, um, my phone now because my camera has died, but we've just got to St. John's Wood, which is in Northwest London very nice area guys very nice area and we've just found a street and i'm just gonna go take photos right here and i've got this crop top on which is from the molly may collection um i've also got my asos um leather pants on a nice shirt on from h&m i believe and my primark bag this vlog is kind of all over the place because my camera died like an hour or so ago so i've been vlogging on my phone but at the same time, obviously I have to take photos. Obviously I have to take photos on my phone. So um, it's like I haven't been able to film whilst I'm taking the photos. So um, I probably just got, I just did another look really quickly. I'll show you the actual photos at the end of this vlog anyway. So you can just see like the locations with alongside the photos. Um, but yeah, we're done. I'm done. I had like two other outfits, but they were like probably my least favorite. So I'm okay with not getting that done. But I got about five looks, right? Yeah. I got about five or six looks. I don't think it was six. I got five looks and we're done. It was getting cold. I'll check back in with you guys shortly where I can show you like the photos that I end up. The lighting's really weird. Yeah, the photos that I end up actually posting. I'll go through them with you guys. So until then. I'll see you shortly. Hey guys, so it's actually been two days since I last checked in with you guys. I wanted to sit down with you guys and go through like the locations. So the video is basically like combination of like vlog style, creating content and like the snappy bits for those who actually are looking for locations to go to. So I'm just going to go through the locations with you that I went to and I'll show you some of the photos that um i have taken but yeah i'm gonna go through these locations with you guys i'm not gonna show you the exact photos that 
I'm gonna end up using but obviously I'm gonna show you the outtakes and bearing in mind like a lot of these photos that I'm showing you aren't even on my Instagram yet I've only got it on my um, feed preview and I'll show you guys the app that I use to like lay out my Instagram like plan it out which I've done I just haven't posted it onto Instagram which is very handy that app by the way guys this first location was actually not planned I wasn't planning on taking photos in a car park I feel like I was past that but I'm definitely not past the car park photos and this was one Canada square car park um, so we planned on parking there and then going outside to take photos at Canary Wharf um, but I was like Do you know what let's just take photos here because this is a very nice car park and it was super quiet bearing in mind all of these locations were actually really quiet so if you're someone that likes the quiet surroundings or a bit shy when you're taking photos you're gonna want to keep watching because that's me basically I'm not shy I feel like it just takes me a second to like kick into gear and then I'm just like forget these people I'm out here <laughs> the lighting I don't know if it's my phone or because I was like in the car park so it wasn't natural lighting but it was a bit blurry but I'm okay with that because when you do these shots they're kind of just like more raw anyway so yeah that's one kind of the square and then we were heading out and there was another car park and it had more of a cleaner and fresher look to it and you know the cars were just shining so this was look too I just thought let me just take some photos here um, obviously I got changed I knew with this outfit I wanted it outside I felt like it needed to be outside so yeah and then look three which was this really cute knitted two piece and actually not a set I got the bottoms from they're both from H&M actually I wanted to be outside for this particularly and I wanted a very clean background but first I took some right here it just did the job like I feel like as long as you've got a clean background you're good to go guys I highly recommend going to Canary Wharf because you can just walk around any corner and take a photo and you're good to go and that's again literally just outside of the car park you come up and through the shopping center and then you just go out um, I'll put the exact location on the video as I always do guys for location number four I'm gonna go with locations rather than outfits because I'm not this isn't really about the outfits it's about the locations um, so location number four this was located in Northwest London um, and it was literally like on the way back to mine because I know that the streets around my area are really nice and clean is this is actually around the corner from the Abbey Road studios you know like the Beatles and all of that jazz and there was like loads of people outside surprisingly it was a never super quiet area and I say surprisingly because a couple streets across there's like loads of fans outside the Abbey Road studios um, and then you come around here and it's literally like there's no one there and it's the perfect street to take photos highly recommend and I'll probably go back there because it's definitely like it's local to me so and I feel like it gives that kind of like cottage style I don't even know I think it's because of the brickwork mixed in with like the neutral tones and it just gives that whole aesthetic that was a really quick one and then location number five was literally a stone throw away I knew I had one more outfit to do and I thought I'm literally above my limit I'm gonna run out of patience so I just thought let's just take a look around I'm gonna make it work and I went down the end of this street turned the corner the location was there I also used the location just around the corner from here too to take more photos in the same look because it had different contrasts around there so I just thought let me just get options whilst I'm here I'll show you guys the app that I use I know that there's a lot of apps that you can plan out your Instagram grid um, but I really love feed preview it's just so easy to navigate around um, but yeah this is my timeline and it's really easy because you can just swap them around and just see if that works and then swap it around again it's helped me so much with like navigating my posts and when I'm gonna post it's cut a lot of corners when it comes to me posting because I always think oh like should I post now or which one should I post instead of going through your whole photo album so what I done after I took all those photos I came home and I planned at least like three other pictures so then it made me feel a lot more content with my Instagram content I've been so rubbish on Instagram recently guys honestly I feel like it was a very proactive day and it makes sense to get all the outputs done in like a couple hours rather than finding a location each day to do each weekend to do one outfit like now that I've done it like this I don't think I'm really ever gonna go back unless I'm actually just out and take a photo obviously um, but yeah guys I highly recommend 
doing a content day. It was a really good experience. I'm gonna do it again. Um, my battery is about to die. Thank you guys for watching this video I hope it helped at least one of you guys when it comes to finding locations in London If you did like it make sure you comment down below like this video and make sure you subscribe and I might do this video again I probably will do this video again because I'm gonna find more locations So yeah, make sure you like comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video Bye